Hey, what's up guys? Um, this is Kevin Moore, the uh, owner and founder of M3 Tactical Tech. Um, what I'm gonna be doing this morning is showing you guys uh, just a brief overview of our scythe. Uh, the scythe is the brand new blade that we just released. Um, we just finished the run. It was a 200 piece run. Uh, we did 100 black handles and 100 OD green handled scythes. Uh, the black handles are reserved for the Legion membership members. Um, you guys will also get your designated serial number and I'll show that uh, that uh, black handled scythe to you after we go over the OD green scythe which is open to everybody. So first, um, the design. Um, Shani designed this blade and um, um, caught my attention right away. So I reached out to him and uh, asked him if it would be okay if M3 manufactured um, this knife to be sold under our brand. And that's what we did. Um, he agreed and um, we got to work on the design right away. It did take us a little bit longer than I had anticipated because it's not a easy blade to manufacture. Um, we also spent a lot of time developing the sheath for this blade, um, which can be carried a number of ways. Um, a lot of guys I think are gonna choose to take some paracord and strap this in wherever they feel comfortable on their uh, plate carrier. <coughs> There's also, these holes are spaced three quarter on center. It'll also take a uh, discrete carry concept clip, which is how I choose to carry mine. Um, if it's not going on my plate carrier, it's gonna be on a discrete carry concept clip either in my pocket or on, attached to my belt. You can also uh, take a blade tech tech lock and attach it that way. And then you can, of course, open the tech lock and attach this to your belt without having to, without having to take your belt off. So the sheath is set up for a quick deploy. So it literally falls right off the knife when you push the top part of the uh, Kydex sheath down. Now it is very secure in here, so listen. So you hear that lock. Sheath is not gonna be coming off or anything like that. Um, that being said, I do recommend that you carry this in a fashion where it's not just gonna fall out if you hit this top part. Because again, we did make that a quick deployment um, to make sure that the blade came out properly. Um, so there was a lot of consideration that went into this knife. Um, so the other thing I wanna show you guys is the uh, different ways that you can hold this blade. So first you can have your thumb resting right here on the jimping with your pinky uh, finger through the ring. Um, so you have this grip method here. You can also choke up on that and keep your thumb on that ramp. You can get it up here in the notch. Um, there's so many ways that you can hold this. Of course, you can go to reverse grip and carry it like that or hold it like that. You can also choke up in reverse grip as well. And uh, this w design was designed this way so that you had multiple grips with, um, with this blade. And uh, the inside of course is razor sharp. I'm gonna be sending one of these blades over to Steve Price, who's a member of the Legion. Um, he also does a lot of videos already um, featuring other knives and makers. And uh, he's pretty well set up for different stuff. Plus he's an unbiased third party. Even though he's a Legion member, he gives me um, his actual uh, feedback and you guys will see how easily how easily the scythe passes through um, whatever media he chooses to use I'm pretty sure he's probably going to use some kind of meat um, a ham hock or something like that but anyways guys this is the m3 scythe and I put the designer's info on the website I'll also copy him on this video um, he did an outstanding job with this design. So a lot of people, <clears throat> they ask me, you know, is this considered a karambit? Um, I would say it's considered a karambit. I'm sure there's some critics out there that are going to have something else to say. 
Um, but this is more, this drastic angle is purposely done. Um, it is more of a hooking weapon. Um, so I've seen some really nas nasty uh, cuts going over somebody's back and pulling up like that. Um, that's a really deep cut. Um, but again, this blade has one purpose in mind and that's self-defense. Um, could you get in trouble for using it? You could get in trouble for using a lot of things. Um, people ask me that all the time too. What happens if you had to use this blade or any blade to defend yourself? If you use a gun to defend yourself, you're gonna end up in the same kind of situation that you would using a knife or a knuckle or any of that kind of stuff. So while you need to know your laws um, and make sure that you follow those, that's important. You also need to consider your personal safety. Um, I joke because if somebody pulled this out, if I didn't have my gun and somebody pulled this out, I probably would run the other way um, because this is a, a very nasty uh, self-defense weapon, um, but very effective. And again, with the hooking ability that you have with this, um, it's not like you can reach out and grab them with the blade, but you have the, the ability to hook and uh, to land that cut and make it a deep cut. Um, so again, guys, this is a, a great piece, whether it's something you're going to collect um, from the M3 line, or if it's something you're gonna carry, um, or if you're gonna use it in a law enforcement or military type atmosphere, um, this is the M3 Scythe, and uh, this is our current design. Um, great job, by the way, brother, on this design. I really, really, I, I can't stop holding this thing. It's so much fun just to hold it. Um, and it's very effective, but I'm going to let Steve Price do his video. So I'm not gonna do any test videos and spoil it for him. I'm gonna let him do that and uh, show you guys. So the black handled scythe is the one that's reserved for the Legion members. If you guys don't know what the Legion membership is, you can go to m3tacticaltech.com. Um, you can type in Legion, L-E-G-I-O-N. Um, once you type in Legion, it'll pop up with Legion membership. Um, Legion membership is $7.99 a month, so I made it very affordable. What you get for your $7.99 is a designated serial number. Um, the important thing there is that we're not going to be serializing any blades or any product outside of Legion only runs. Um, so going forward, when we do a run of knives or anything, um, it's either going to be one-offs or sets. Um, but anytime we put a serial number on there, it's only going to be <coughs> serial numbers for guys that have pre-ordered, guys or girls that have pre-ordered, that have a Legion membership. That helps keep your serial numbers safe. It helps add value to the membership um, and adds value to our, um, to our company. Um, the other thing that you get is 15% off um, any orders. So anytime you order, oh, it's coming. So anytime you order something on the website, it's 15% off. And the website is gonna be where we do all of our transactions. Um, in the past, I've done some PayPal's here and there, but um, the main thing is now we're running everything through the website so that we can track our sales. And uh, so that the other thing that it does is it helps me remember to ship stuff. Um, you guys know how I am with shipping. I ship stuff out right away. Um, if I got 10 or 12 orders like I usually do, it's easy to lose track and forget one because it's not being tracked on the website. Um, so anyways, guys, you get 15% off, uh, guys and gals. You get 15% off, and then you also get your own serial number. Now, that doesn't commit you to have to buy everything that we make. That just means that if you pre-order, you're going to get your serial, your serial number engraved on the knife. And it's going to be set apart from anything else that we make. So it's not going to look like all the other ones. So the Legion-only sites have black handles. They're also going to have the Legion logo on this side, um, as well as the M3 logo here, and then your Legion serial number up here <clears throat> so i will not be selling any of the black handled scythes i have a hundred of them unless it's going to a legion member um, i've already started selling those in the legion page so there is group access i'm sorry there's legion only access to the legion page 
it's an M3 Legion um, Facebook page. We have an M3 Legion Instagram. Um, they're all private, secret, closed groups. Um, once you purchase a Legion membership, I add you to the discount code for 15% off, and then I also add you to the groups and chats that we have going for the Legion. Um, so anyways, guys, Legion sales are going on right now for the Black Handled site. So if you're a Legion member, if you don't already know this, um, you know now. All right, guys, that's it for today. Um, I'm Kevin Moore, and I uh, would just wish you guys the best day. Thanks for watching this video. Um, if you watched it in its entirety, I really appreciate that. And again, if you're looking for the scythe, you can go to m3tacticaltech.com. You can type in scythe, S-C-Y-T-H-E. Um, and if you're looking for the Legion membership, you can type in Legion, L-E-G-I-O-N. Thanks, guys. You guys have a great day. Kevin Moore's out.